We've all seen the commercials, the ads for those DNA kits that tell you all about you mm -hmm. and where you're from. That's right. And new six anchor Ginger Gadsden joins us now. Ginger, this was your idea for all of us to try this out. <laughs> I've been trying to get this story done for a couple of years now. And you now. opened a can of worms. I really yeah. did. But I love it. I think it's really important. There's something interesting about knowing your roots and where you're from. And now the process is easier than ever with mail-in DNA kits. All you have to do is put some saliva in a small tube, pack it up, send it off, and six to eight weeks later, you get your results. We're going to let the Scandinavian go first over there. Whoa. Well, that's There's a shock. Three things? I know. We thought I was going to be all one thing, right? Oh, my so. God. You might be royalty. I think we knew that. 60% Great Britain. Other what are the uh, Let's see what the others are. Yeah. Oh, gosh. Okay. So 60% Great Britain, 22% Ireland, 7% Europe East. Oh. Oh, shocking, guys. Early settlers of eastern Kentucky and northeast Tennessee. <laughs> Can you believe that? That's crazy. <laughs> the thing that this shows, though, is that it's pretty legit. I have no think? clue. Yeah. I don't know. Clearly, um, African. But I have no, no idea no, no, where. Like where? No yeah. clue. Nigerian. Have you ever heard anything about your ancestors from Nigeria? No, nothing. It's so really now that you see this, like, do you want to enter in more information and see if you of can course, find, like, yeah. of you know, course, track. and find like, what if I find some people who I'm related to in Nigeria or whatever? I mean, I yeah. think it could happen because I feel like it has a part of my parents in there, mm -hmm. and so I think that's what's special because they're not around anymore. So I think that's part of them too. So it makes me want to know more about where they came from. So anyway, I think that's awesome. So Matt, you think you're Italian. Let's see what daddy is. You're a quarter Italian. <laughs> and a little bit Irish. British? Gosh. So Matt, what they're saying is we're not related. <laughs> so my dad's family's all from Virginia. We are related Tennessee. You better Kentucky. keep me out of Kentucky. <laughs> this better not say Tennessee. You're stuck with me. Oh, oh Julie and I are Brother and sister. Oh Let's all set this up. You are adopted. Correct. Yeah. Yes. You know your biological parents. That's right. Mm -hmm. I was adopted when I was about two years old. I lived in foster care prior to that. According to them, my mother's last name was Echeverry, which is Basque. And then my father's last name was Delorme, which is French. So I think that I have a lot of French. Ireland. Oh, Scandinavia. Scandinavia. 54% other. Wow. <laughs> the majority of you is Irish? I wouldn't have guessed that. I know, right? And Scandinavian. My birth mother does have blue eyes. This is interesting because I'm looking at the link or the app now and it says close family, possible range. So this person might actually be a sibling of mine. What? No way. Yes, because that's my biological father. Oh, and I know he has a son named Robbie and this person's initials are RH from Ventura, California. And that's where Robbie was born. I will send a message. Well, there I will be a follow up. <laughs> yeah. it's, it's, Related. Okay, Ginger. Uh, no, there is going to be <laughs> some did. No, but don't, are you glad you did yeah, that? No, it's been wonderful, and I've actually contacted him now. Yeah. He is uh, about 12 years older than me, married with two kids, um, never knew that I ever existed, and yeah. was just fascinated by this. I thought maybe he was doing this to try and find you know, yeah, relatives, because sure. he lived with his birth mother but never knew anything about his dad. We yeah. have the same dad. Um, he said no, his wife was just curious and just did it. and. Had no idea that yeah. this would happen. And since so. she did it, it linked him to you. Correct. Crazy. Oh yes. my gosh. Yes. Oh, so love that. Mm -hmm. But I'm interested to hear more about what you find yeah. out. Well, I have posted a, a video about my adoption story on our website, as well as some information explaining how the tests work, because, Ginger, it was fascinating. Uh, head so to cool. clickorlando.com and find it right there on the home page. Yeah. And I'm glad no one was really disappointed. Everyone's really excited. He was yeah. disappointed. No, well, no. Was disappointed. Not, not I mean, I, I thought it was going to be something like crazy cool in there. Well, but, we could have told you that before doing uh, the test. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. He thought he was going to be tiger blood. He got me there. Yeah, it's negative for tiger blood. Thank you very much, Ginger. That was awesome.